Hello and welcome to Top10List.org, where you get a world of knowledge and 10 simple points. Today's episode is going to be about our top 10 best-selling mystery writers of all time. Let's start at number 10 with John Grisham. Technically, he cannot be termed as a mystery writer, but his books do have legal mysteries embedded within them. With over 250 million sales worldwide, his books have been translated into 29 languages. Each new book is greeted with immense fanfare and acclaim, and he is only one of two authors whose books has sold 2 million copies at first printing. Number 9 is Mickey Spillane. Seven of the 50 best-selling books in America were written by Spillane. This in itself is a manifestation of his popularity. His detective, Mike Hammer, made his first appearance in the book, I, the Jury. The book by itself sold over 6.5 million in the U.S. Many other books followed, though none of them achieved the success of the first one, they still succeeded in making him one of the best-selling authors of all time. Number 8 is Rex Stout. Nero Wolfe is one of America's best-known idiosyncratic detectives. Created by Stout, this overly large, indulgent detective has been very well liked by mystery readers of all generations. An armchair detective of the First Order, Nero Wolf's stories are narrated by his friend and assistant, Archie Goodwin. Rex Stout combined snappy dialogue with intriguing stories and presented us with a series which have remained on the best-selling list for years. Number 7 is Ian Fleming. The creator of James Bond and his books flew off the shelves as soon as they were released. He sold over 100 million copies of his books, and even though now the films about his main protagonist have become more popular, for a long time he was one of the best-selling mystery writers. Number 6, John Lee Kerr. Many believe him to be the best mystery writer of all time. His books cannot be really classified as mysteries, since they were more concerned with interpersonal relations, corporate wrangles, and above all the relationships between the governments of countries. A brilliant writer, his books are superbly crafted and written with immense grace and style. Number five is Earl Stanley Gardner. He sold over a hundred million and his lawyer Perry Mason became one of the bane of most practicing lawyers in the US. Every litigant began to expect his lawyer to eventually solve all crimes and find the right killer. Clever legal systems, fast action, and good mystery stories are what marked this prolific and best-selling writer's career. Number four is Ellery Queen. The first book written by two friends under the pseudonym was released in 1934. And over eight decades later, his books are still very popular. They have instituted a much-coveted Mystery Writers Award in his name. The books are excellent whodunit mysteries, and they are very elegantly crafted and intellectually challenging. Number three is Arthur Conan Doyle. Sherlock Holmes' deductive and reasoning abilities have astonished readers for many years. Sir Arthur Conan Doyle gave us a series of mysteries which have enchanted and confounded us. He also wrote science fiction books, plays, poetry, non-fiction books, and some historical novels. But he is best remembered for a series of books with Holmes as their central character, accompanied by Watson. Number two is Agatha Christie. The Guinness Book of Records lists her as the best-selling book writer of all time, with over four billion copies of her books having been published worldwide. Her mystery novels were never too long. The stories were superb, and the characterization of her detectives, such as Hercules Perroy and Miss Marple, were very well done. She wrote about 80 detective novels and some plays, and also some romantic novels under the pseudonym Mary West McCott. Number one is Georges Simenon. The creator of Inspector Magritte was a prolific writer and wrote over 500 books. He is considered to be the forerunner of the police detective genre of books, and his books followed the simple formula of murder, investigations, clues, and eventually to the arrest of the murderer. Simply written and set in Paris, the books have remained ever popular even 80 years after his first book was published. Thank you for joining us on this edition of Top 10 for best-selling mystery writers of all times. If you find yourself nose deep in one of these books, don't forget to click subscribe, give us a like, and join us again for another edition of Top 10 List.